Scientists in Germany are now potty training cows. 11 out of the 16 cows actually learn how to use it. For the other five, researchers were heard yelling, Go now, brown cow! <laughs> Squeeze your sirloins! Let's go! <laughs> I like this story. It's kind of smart what's going on. And uh, it could save the planet, Marcus, because uh, scientists in Germany are now potty training cows. What? I'm like, what took so long to figure this out? Have you ever had to potty train anything, your, your kids? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> well, yeah, kids, but you know, pets, dogs. And yeah. Dogs, cats. It's I mean, no they can, easy chore. I can imagine a cow. Yes. Well, as it turns out, cows can be potty trained just as easily as toddlers, maybe even easier, and that is no BS. Uh, a lab in a town unfortunately named uh, Dummerstorf. That's the name of the town in Germany, Dummerstorf. I thought Hickory was a bad name, but Dummerstorf? Still not as bad as that town in Virginia, Damascus. You ever been to Damascus? Um, researchers there in uh, Dummerstorf, they mimic the way toddlers potty train. They put cows in a special pen, and it's called the Moo Lu. You know, like I got to use the loo, the toilet, right. moo loo. It's a bathroom for bovines. Uh, it's a he- it's the head for heifers. What it is, and when they're finished, they clean up uh, in the water loo. Abba loves it. Um, Eleven out of the sixteen cows actually learn how to use it. For the other five, researchers were heard yelling, "Go now, brown cow! <laughs> Squeeze your sirloins! Let's go!" <laughs> When they uh, urinated in the mulu, they were rewarded with a little treat. Um, what do you think they gave the, the cows as a treat? Uh, Wasn't a cheeseburger. <laughs> dog that, that would be insulting. Dog biscuit. Uh, dog biscuit might work. Um, it was actually, it turns out they have a sweet tooth, and they gave them molasses. Um, and that, uh, yeah, just, you ever had molasses? Was the last time you had molasses? You can't eat molasses. What am I thinking of? It's molasses. Too sweet. Nah, it's just like syrup, right? Yeah, it's It's just all sugar, right? Um, So that's what they gave them. And if the cows did not use the mulu, they were punished with a cold squirt of water. (laughs) Like a bad cat. Yeah. You know, get get off the counter. (laughs) Uh, I'm assuming assuming it was a a squirt to the face, you know, not like the not like a bidet up in there in the mulu, you know, not a shot to the Angus. It's uh, I think it's a good thing, to be honest with you. Um, they say it took only 15 days to train the young calves to use the mulu, then another 15 days to put the seat back down. <laughs> JK. Most kids <laughs> take a long time. Do you remember how long it took you to potty train your kids? Yeah, I mean, we had to have them aim it, have my son aim it, uh, Cheerios. Cheerios? Yeah. Inside of the toilet? Yeah, 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 yeah. Also, oh, wouldn't splatter? Yeah. Well, Give him something you'd, to aim you'd at. Aim, you'd hit it, yeah. Yeah. My mom said, I asked her about this. She said, it took, took me three months to, three months to, to potty, potty train. And I, I I still prefer to go pee in a pasture. Oh, but yeah. It's, it's more fun to pee outside. Right. Yeah, outside's fun. Yeah. Uh, I think it's a good thing because uh, too much urine is a problem. Urine contains nitrogen, and when it's mixed with cow pies, makes ammonia, which is an environmental issue. It's kind of like that Luke Bryan song. What? How's it go? <laughs> Rain makes corn. Corn makes whiskey. <laughs> whiskey. And pneumonia is, makes acid rain. Acid rain is a bad thing. That's what it is. Um, cows do pee a lot. How many gallons do y'all think one cow pees a day? You want to make any guesses? Ten. Ten? Ten. Seven. Seven. Eight gallons. Yeah. He was very That's close. Eight gallons a day. I mean, a racehorse... Is two gallons, and everyone says I got to pee like a racehorse, but really you sh- they should be saying I got to pee like a cow, like a heifer. You know, uh, both are way more than humans. Uh, humans don't even go a full liter a day, huh? Unless it's a human who's in front of me at a stall somewhere, and I got to go. And you wait. That guy's yeah. doing like he's got eight gallons in there. Um, I'm like, move it, Sea Biscuit. I got to go. Uh, potty training animals could make it easier to manage waste products and reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Now, sadly, they did not test for number two, 
They only train cows to use the mulu to urinate, not defecate. Oh. So, yeah, it's not a moo pulu. It's just a mulu for the pee pee, which, ironically, the moo pulu is number two at Panda Express. You ever had a moo pulu? <laughs> no. no, it's great with soy sauce. Okay. Yeah, you got to get one of those. They do predict, however, they could just as easily train cows to poop in certain places as well. You just have to steer them. Uh, but apparently, urine is the bigger problem in Europe because they're European. <laughs> European. But the biggest problem from cows is the heat trapping gas methane, which they emit when they burp or fart, also known as dairy air. And just like my brother Jason, they cannot be trained to stop burping. Or farting. They Just blow like up. Your brother, yeah. Just like Jason. You've been in a tent with my brother. Oh, Lord. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. They say that it would, the cow would blow up if they stopped burping or farting, which ironically is what my brother does to a tent on a camping trip. Blows it up. He just, man, I, I, I feel sorry for you guys that was in that tent. Did one of you just, you got to put up this. Did you hit it? Mm-hmm. When you do I hit it. I dragged my foot. Did you? Oh, I, I swear. I heard it. Say. So you got all these sound effects, man. Perfect time for a fart noise right there. I thought Elliot actually farted. I did too. No, I thought he did too. <laughs> New shoes. That cheeseburger. <laughs> That's right. Well, yeah, I feel bad we're eating a cheeseburger up in here today. You know? Um, so anyway, uh, I guess the, the message here is uh, eat more chicken. Hey, it's me again. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you liked that. If you did, you, uh, you should check out the entire episode. It's a blast. And then if you're going to do that, you might as well subscribe. And then, you know, if you're going to subscribe, you might as well hit the notification bell. All right? And, uh, and know that I love you. <laughs> <laughs>